okay guys so right now i've generated um ai images for this lady okay and you can see the watermark there so i have gone through the images i've deleted the ones i don't want so there are about 25 left so instead of cropping and cropping a beautiful part out all right so this is a video that i'm going to show you how you can remove the watermark so the website is watermarkremover.io so look at it there watermarkremover.io this is the website okay you can actually do it one after the other if you if it's only one you are interested in so let's do the one for one and we are going to do the one for the book so right here you select the one you want to remove you click on done is uploading the image right now so you just have to exercise patience why the image is being uploaded on the website so once you finish uploading it's going to remove the watermark completely and still retain the brightness of the image so you can see it right here you can see the first one has watermark the second one still has watermark so but they will not ask you to turn it on so if there's a logo it will remove it if there's a watermark it will remove it so i'm saying remove text so i'll click on on okay so you can see right here is is removing it is removing it is removing it and on this website you can actually do many other things you can actually increase the brightness of the image right put a new background do many other look at a um upscale so upscale is where you increase the brightness of the image okay so the it has finished up um, removing the watermark so you can see it the first one watermark removed right and you can actually download it here instantly okay so let's go and download it all right so right here now it is downloading so we've done how to remove one background okay one image so how do you now remove in bulk to remove in bulk you have to gain early access they say want to remove watermark from images in bulk get early access so you click on get early access i've already signed up on this platform before all right i've already signed up but because of this tutorial i'm going to be signing up afresh okay using another um gmail okay so that you guys can see everything step by step so i'm very sure you appreciate that if you appreciate it make sure you like the video okay like the video so i've already showed you how you can delete remove watermark um from a single picture right now so let's look at how to remove watermark in bulk in bulk all right so we go back to the website okay remove watermarkremover.io okay so this is the website so this is where you remove just a single picture all right i've already showed you that so right now you are going to sign up click on this get early access okay click on get early access okay you are going to see it now they're asking you to sign up this is where you sign up free this is the paid version okay so you can actually get it sign up for free so i've already done i've already signed up on this website before but i'm going to sign up again using another of my accounts so you can see right now i already have a profile here you get i already have a profile here you get so but i want to sign up so i have to log out you get so i already have a profile down here okay so what i'll just do is to log out okay log out and sign up using another account so because they said i've used up my credit 95 percent that means once i use up my credit it looks as if i can't do any other thing so that means i'll be doing it only one because you can remove watermark just in a single picture single picture okay but if you want it in bulk you must sign up so let me log out so you see i've logged out so i'm going to get started for free so this is what you're going to see when you are starting afresh so i want to use another account so i'm let me click on get started for free so you see it so right here you see email and password don't use this email and password section just click on continue with google okay just directly use your google it's faster 
so they will show you your google account so you will now choose one okay so let me choose one of them to use it to sign up so once you select the gmail you want to use you change the phone number so i'll look for my country and i'll now put my phone number here so right here they will show you welcome individual or for company do you get you know one thing one thing is that whenever they just ask you company stuff they might charge you higher for company so just use individual and run away from any other thing so just say media and entertainment so you see they are giving you cloud something cloud names here i don't know what it is for okay click on continue so you can see it right here I have already signed up with another account so they, they are now showing you how to use the, the the platform the website so the first thing is to click on upload once you've uploaded you choose the file okay okay so this is this is where you choose the file so you see you have file you have folder you have zip files right the best I used when I did this is zip file and that's what I'm going to teach you guys how to use so right now you are going to go back to your gallery so this is my gallery you go back to your remini so you see this is your remini here okay you can see this work the watermark is still on it okay so what you are going to do is to go to arrow AR this app here for zipping documents okay you can download it from play store okay you have to go to that app so i'll now look for my remini okay see remini here so do you see all the pictures in remini so you will see this one here i've already zipped a file in here do you see it so but let me show you how to zip so let's see this one not right now so if it's all this one here you want to zip it afresh i've already zipped some before so but here this is how to zip you select the images you want to zip okay so this should be so i don't know how many images there are so but all these ones i've selected them i'm going to what unzip them okay i'm going to zip them so once you do it you will now click on this place see this one here plus this one here click on it so they are showing you RAR they are showing you zip so you click on zip don't set any password there is no need for it so they ask you delete files after archiving do you get um, I don't want to delete the files after archiving I can delete them later so you can see right here you see the name is Remini dot zip I just zipped it okay it is still the same thing that is in this Ado Jaliwa do you get it now yes so now you have zipped your file you will now go back to the website okay so maybe before you come to this website you can zip the file you want to zip all of them so you now okay guys so you have to know where your zip file is okay so i'll click on browse zip files okay i'll just look for the folder so look at it here i actually had to get it from my file manager and put it in this folder i was searching for it i can't find it so look at it here i'll select it that's it so it is going to upload so you see there are 25 of them they will start uploading right here okay so you just have to wait for it to finish uploading right now it has finished uploading okay so you click on this i remove button you remove that it has uploaded all right so your work has uploaded okay so after it has uploaded look at where you will click you will go to storage okay so this is your dashboard once you have uploaded your work you go to storage okay and inside storage i'm going to see the folder here so this is the folder you click on it so this is the folder right, right here so these are all the images inside the folder okay so what you are going to do next is to work on it.
So if you start taking it one by one, transform is going to remove the image. Okay, but I'm not transforming it one by one. So I have to just select the whole file. So you see where they're showing you select. So you select all of them. So make sure it is at the edge of that um, box that you are clicking. If you go and click inside the picture, you have to start afresh trying to select it. So I'm going to items on this page are selected. So once you finish selecting it, the next place you are going to click on is here. Okay, that is where you transform all of them together. Click on there. So they are asking you for a preset and all that. The, the preset you just want is just to remove watermark. So that's just watermark. So you see, you just tap on remove watermark. Okay, this is it. You search for it. Okay, remove watermark. You select it. So they ask you what you want to remove. Is it the logo on the images or the text? The what is on that text is just on the pictures. It's just text, which is a mini text. I click on remove text. Then once you do that, you click on apply. So it is applied. So you can see where they are showing you applied. So you can click on export. Now, when you are exporting, they will ask you how do you want to export it. I'm exporting as zip file. Okay, so that I can also unzip it later. So I'll click on download as zip file. So you see it has already downloaded. So they're asking you to view it. So click on view job. Okay. So if you don't know where you where the view job is, this is the where you get it this folder here all right so that's where you get it so that arrow so you see this is the work 853 i just downloaded it it said work in progress meaning it is not yet done okay so once it's done this place will give you load opportunity here to download it into your phone okay so let's you have to still wait or so you can see right now it has succeeded it's complete so the next thing you are going to click is on action you download it into your phone so right now it is downloading it's going to download as a zip file so you can see even the size will be big that's 8 mb okay so once it's finished downloading what you are just going to do next is to unzip it and it will now enter into your phone gallery you get so let me just wait for it to finish downloading and i will unzip it and it will enter my phone gallery okay guys so right now it has finished downloading so this is it so i'll click on it they will ask you to open it so you can use either your ruar to open it or you can open it extract the file to your phone instantly so let's use ruar okay so this is it these are all the files so right here you can actually so this is the file so let's select all of them should be 25 so this is 25 of them so you can create a new folder for it into a folder so we are going to send it Let's just send it to this download and see. Don't like. So just know the folder. The most important is just for you to know the folder where you sent it. So look at it here. It has ended download. So check it out. No watermark. Check it out. All of them. No watermark. Okay. Check it out without cropping anything. Do you get it? So once you can get it on this, you are now have it on this download. You can just create. Um, a new folder for all of them then you can now proceed to lightroom or whichever editing app you want to use to now begin to edit it so that's just what you need to do so we'll create a new folder all right and we move everything to the folder so this is how to remove your watermark. I hope the video is very, very clear. So if you have any question, let me know in the comment section. Okay.